has really come out of nowhere this season for Ranieri. She takes a big cut and misses strike three swinging. Ranieri is down for out number one. And that's that's big, Brandon, like you, for, for Kalanaki. Again, all 40 games this year. The 0-1 is lifted in the air. This is in the outfield, and it's playable in center, right center, ranging to her left is Karina to make the play, and the inning is over. The, the payoff is grounded to short with Zniewski to her right. She throws the first in time to get a hustling tank knee and retire the side. The play goes four to three. The Grizzlies get a runner in scoring position, but leave her there. Dorfler can scratch out the first base runner for the Crusaders, and she lost one, a blooper on the infield. It's bobbled at second base by Kissman. We'll await the scoring. It is a base hit. It's the first hit of the game as Angie Dorfler loops one over the circle the first at bat but he knew from her approach as here's a big one-two pitch on the way it's lifted in the air this is deep this ball is back and it's going to get down it hits off the fence in left field and around third in scoring on the play is going to be Angie Dorfler it's a two-out double off the bat of Caitlin Ranieri to put the Crusaders in front one nothing Valpo yeah that one hit to the deep part of the park Brandon left McShane 0 for 1 on the day she flew out on the infield her first time this pitch is lined oh! and a great play. Made at third base by Muron to take a hey. base hit away from Tara McShane. Beautiful play for a Muron, Brandon. She has five strikeouts already on the day. This pitch is lifted oh deep boy. to center. This ball is back and gone. Sam Stewart homers for the second straight day. A long home run to straightaway center field. Home run number four on the season. Stewart looking comfortable in the box, as we mentioned a moment ago. Launches one over the center field fence. It's 2-0 Valpo. I guess she's feeling better about herself, Brandon. Deepest part of the park, and Samantha Stewart drives it. She was trying to get in on the tennis action over there. And could possibly add another one here. The 2-1 is lined to right. This is going to be caught on a line by Ranieri in right field, tagging and moving up to third base, diving head first is Kissman. But now they're two down with a runner on third. A big out there for Sierra Pico. The one strike pitch is driven to center. This is going to get down in front of the center fielder Lawson and allow Oakland to move a step closer. Now it's two to one. Oakland finally on the board after their first run was Taken away, and she will, in fact, add to her RBI total. Now we're set for the 0-2 pitch. It's grounded right back up the middle, a base hit, and the tying run is on for the Grizzlies. Nice bit of hitting there by Sarah Hartley. and Weisenhofer ready to work. The payoff is driven to right center, a base hit, and now there are two on with nobody out. The Grizzlies in business in the seventh. Huge hit for the one two is called strike three. The ball game is over. The Crusaders hold on to defeat the Oakland Grizzlies by the score of two to one. The Grizzlies load the bases in the seventh inning, but Weisenhofer escapes with a strike out there to end it. That's the way it comes to a close. Valpo two, Oakland one. Strong mental.